Hey guys, Mixed Media Girl here. So we are back with our skull painting. So this dried super awesome. You can see it's super textured canvas. The purple did this kind of crazy thing in the corner over here. Um, yeah, so if you did not see the original video, I will put the link down in the description. Please check it out. It's pretty awesome. But now we're going on to our next step, which is starting with glow in the dark paint. I'm going to cover virtually the whole canvas with it for this step, and then we're gonna go do the next part. So here we go. Okay, so I painted most of the background here and then a lot of the skull. It's a little hard to get so detailed on the skull in the light. So at this point, I am going to turn on the black light and do the rest in the dark. Um, so we're going to do that. Okay, that's looking pretty awesome. We're gonna let this fully dry and then move on to the next stage. All right, so our next step is we're gonna use some of this. This is called Montana Marble. It is so cool. I don't wanna get any on the skull directly, so I made him a little plastic covering. And basically, that didn't work out so well. <laughs> that's okay. We're just going to spray around and um, remember that uh, there's the glow in the dark underneath this. So this is going to kind of, that's just not working at all. Okay. I'm just not going to spray on him. <laughs> this is going to cover up some of that. So theoretically in the dark, it'll look super cool. And for those who don't know what the Montana Marble is, it's kind of like a spray paint silly string stuff. It's really cool. I did a video on it a while back. I'll put the link for that in the description too, in case you didn't see it. A little bit more. Okay, awesome. So we're gonna let that dry and then we're, we're gonna put epoxy on it is our next step. I'm not gonna epoxy the skull, I'm just gonna epoxy around it. Um, yeah, so I'm actually gonna take this outside and do a spray sealer first and then we'll epoxy it. We'll be back. All right, we're back. So I just sprayed this with the uh, Rust-Oleum, not the rest of the canvas because I'm not going to put it, uh, the epoxy there. I'm just going to put it all over there. And I've got my epoxy all mixed up. I'm using Stone Coat Countertops Art Coat and just mixed up a few ounces here. So we're going to get this canvas covered.
right, so we're gonna go ahead and do our close up and then we're gonna see how this looks in the dark now that we have that Montana marble on there and the resin. All right, so it is, of course, extra glossy, uh, but I love all the different layers on here. Um, and I actually love that the glow in the dark paint gave it kind of a bit of a cloudy effect. You can sort of see the Montana marble down there. Um, you still, we still have lots of texture on this canvas, which is really cool. So the, the resin did not cover all of that up, which is really cool. There you go. Our skull. Let's see how this looks in the dark. All right, this is with the trusty black light. So you can see it's different from when we looked at it in the dark before because of the Montana marble. It gave it um, more of like a grungy background look. While the skull is still pretty much all glow in the dark in the right spots. And then let's go ahead and we'll turn out the lights and see how it looks just in the dark. It's only gonna glow for a second here, but that's enough to see how cool it looks. Here we go. All right, guys. So I hope you love this as much as I do. This piece is for sale, so let me know if you're interested. Um, otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys next time.